Hello there, Pisces. Welcome. This is your April 2022 love reading. Let's see what's happening for our Pisces. We have energy cords. Despite the distance between you, they still feel the energetic cords that is keeping you two connected. So they are connected. They feel it. You feel it. They feel it. Solitude. Time spent in solitude has given them a chance to get to know themselves better and set a more solid foundation. They're working on themselves. Okay, and then we have release. When they when they set you free, they felt the sting from your absence. Don't let their silence fool you, because they're feeling you and they're thinking about you. And then we have for the past, they are aligning to the frequency of love and operating at a high frequency vibration with openness to receiving. Ooh, they, they definitely did some work on themselves in the past if they're able to do that. Because this connection is so strong. And crowning you, we have grieving. They're stuck in grief, unable to see that they still have the power to create a positive change. So I think this person goes back and forth. They, they probably don't see the results they want to see. Because sometimes what's happening is underneath. You don't really see it. You don't. You can't really. It's not something solid. But it is happening. It's supposed to be a frequency. And we have coming in. Breaking free. They are freeing themselves from their self-imposed prison and leaving behind all that kept them away from you, which I would think would be other people interfering, trying to keep you guys apart. Okay, now, missing you. Their life feels empty without you. Aw, they miss you more than words can say, but they think it's too late to fix things. Okay, I, I feel this person feels like they're on a seesaw. Okay, regret. They are having a hard time forgiving themselves for treating you poorly, much less expecting you to forgive them. Yeah, they're they're punishing themselves. And then we have sexual union. Their greatest sex memory is with you, but it's more than just sex. It's their memory of feeling so close to you. Yeah, but this is a really deep connection. Okay, let's see what's coming out for possible outcome. Dreams. They've been dreaming so much about you and want to manifest their dreams into reality. Okay, and then we have taunted. Their vivid dreams haunt them. They dream of how they broke your heart and you're moving on with someone else. And then we have coming apart. Meeting you was unexpected. You changed their whole world forever. Feeling lost as they lost their own identity. Wow. <laughs> I'm gonna fix these. Try and do it with one hand. It's not working. They're, they're getting a little slippery here. Okay. Now, and this is unseen factors. There's more to this love story, though you cannot see it now. There's still much more to unfold. That's what it is. There's things that you're not seeing. <clears throat> they may not see, uh, and even with them too, they don't. They think that things should be moving faster, but they're moving. You know, everything happens at the right time. And it's not fast enough for them because they want to reconnect with you. And they're getting a little impatient. I'm feeling someone feeling like they're chomping at the bit here. Getting a little impatient. Okay, now, energy cords. Let's clarify the energy cords. Why do we have energy cords here for Pisces? We have three of wands awaiting results. See, this person, they're waiting and they're impatient. But they're waiting for something to happen. They sent something in motion there. I think before they could come towards you, they have to, um, this has to um, work out here. What do we have? Solitude here? That's so cross here. Okay, solitude goes here, right? Okay, hopefully it will. Doesn't matter. I'm still going to be reading the card here. Solitude. Yeah, because this was released. Okay, solitude. Person's by themselves trying to think of what to do here. Ooh. Yeah, they're, they're alone because they're having tower moments. There's things falling apart around them. And that's why they, they don't want to come to you until they're whole. And they don't have all this drama and all this stuff going on. Because now there's a tower. After the tower comes the star, though. So they're experiencing something heavy here. Right, what about release? Why do we have release here? Knight of Wands, Passion and Adventure. This person wants to come towards you super quick. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius could be any sign, but they have a lot of passion. And the Knight of Wands is Don Juan, Don Juan. Don, you know what? They, they're they very impulsive. So this person might just show up. 
Because <laughs> they won't be able to take it anymore. And they're just going to show up. Let's see here. We have frequency. Ace of Swords. Breakthrough and awareness. Yes. This person is making major breakthroughs. They don't feel like it's fast enough because they really want to be with you. They really miss you. But they are making major breakthroughs. Cutting out the stuff that does not serve them. To make room for the new stuff. To come in with the truth and honesty. And yeah. Let's see. Grieving. Why do we have grieving here? Yeah, Hierophant, spiritual advisement, Taurus energy. This person wants a long-term commitment. They want marriage. They're really missing you. And this break and free. Why do we have that here? And we have King of Cups, emotional mastery. Now, see, this person's breaking free from maybe um, not expressing themselves, holding back their emotions. Now, they want to come in here and they, they're breaking free from this prison of not talking, of not expressing themselves, of not being vulnerable to you. Because if they're vulnerable to you, you guys would still be together. Okay, missing you. Let's see, why do we have the missing? And the Scorpio Cancer Pisces with the um, King of Cups. Could be any sign though. Okay, here's Pisces energy. Hangman. So you're coming up a lot here. New perspective. They're missing you, but they're seeing things. They've seen the reason why you had to be separated. They understand that they had some some work to do in order to come toward through again. And they want to come through and fix things, but they're hoping that it's not too late because this took a long time to happen. Busy with the hangman. That means that it took a long time. Now this regret. Why do we have this regret here? Borosaurus, healing and recovery. Yeah, they're trying. They want to heal this situation and they're healing. They know they have to heal before they can come to you. They can't come to you and be in a hot mess because then it just won't work. You close the door on their face. What about sexual union here? Why do we have sexual union? Chariot, charging ahead. Yes, see, they're, they have such a, they're passionate about you. See, we have this sexual union with the chariot cancer energy this person is coming fast once they get everything done where they can they can move forward they are gonna they're gonna be on you so quick <laughs> so be ready okay what about dreams why are the dreams here and we had nine of cups satisfaction and wish fulfillment look at that wishes and dreams come true they dream that you are together and they're and that everything is fine and everything is great and every and you and then they wake up and say oh shoot that's a dream that wasn't real how sad okay now haunted why do we have haunted here three of pentacles collaboration yes they're haunted because they want to work on things and they didn't with you in the past they didn't put the work in and that is haunting them missing you is haunting them what about this coming apart we have yeah, nine of wands, trials and tribulations. This is like they should have fought for this. They should have protected this union, and they didn't. And now they're coming apart because of it. It's just they didn't do what they're supposed to do. Bottom, we have six of pentacles, equality. They want to make things right. They want to balance things out. They want things to be equal. And they know they have to do it because you were given, and, and they were taken. They weren't contributing like you were. Okay, guys, let's see what signs we could be dealing with. <laughs> Some heavy duty energy lately. A lot of passion. Very intense. Okay, what signs are we dealing with for Pisces, please? We have Gemini. Cancer. Sagittarius. Pisces. Scorpio. I'm always amazed why these water... Is, there's a lot of emotions coming out lately because in almost every reading, all the water signs come out. And we have Virgo. Okay, so this could be placements in your chart, placement in person chart, placement on other people's charts. Maybe even people you haven't met yet that might come into um, around you or, you know, into your, I'm going to say atmosphere. <laughs> well, you might be meeting up with new people or meeting new people or maybe whoever's around you in your circumstance here so um we have gemini cancer sagittarius pisces scorpio and virgo okay so please take what resonates leave what doesn't and now oh wait i keep on forgetting i don't see these in front of me i want to pull a couple of these for you let's see what else we have here and then i'll go for the dice and also i'll, I'll draw some names so i'm not gonna read the whole list anymore it's too many <laughs> haystack let's see karma you will reap what you have sown so if you've been good, you're going to get good. If you've been bad, you're going to get bad. That's the way karma works. And the bouquet. 
Compliments from an admirer. Ooh. This person is going to be very complimentary. You got the Knight of Wands. They like to, you know, ham it up here. And, and scissors. Disappointment in some affair. One more. Might be cutting somebody out here. And then we have rainbow. The most difficult part of the situation is over. Wow, that's great. Now, let's see what letters we have here. So this could be your initials, your first name, your last name, your person's initials, first, last name. Could be other people are coming in. So let's see, I'm doing 11 die. And then I'm going to do 11 names. So we have 11, 11. Unless more get pulled out on the names. Like, you know, sometimes that gets a little more. It's hard to, I'm shaking them out. So L-A- K B I T Oops, 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 oops. Now which way did it fall? Well, hang on a second. Let me grab it off the floor here. And I'm pulling up the oh, it's a W. So we have a W. D V H last one and another B one two three four five six seven eight nine ten okay there we go our eleven so we have L A K B I T W D V H B. Now for the names. So what names do we have for you guys? We just fall, oh, there's one came out. Whoop. Trying to get down to the bottom here. Okay, let me see how many I got. Now I'll get more. We have Tiffany. Sharice. Chauncey, Camera, Sheila, Sheila, I never say that name right for some weird reason, Lamont, Stephen, Seven, Okay, these in my hand. Who do we have here? We have Marilda Janai J A N A I and Amy five six ten. Need one more. What's the luck? Last lucky one. What is it? We have Matt M A T T Matt. Okay, guys. So please take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Um, please leave me, um, let me know if it resonates. Please leave me comments. Let me know what you think. Um, if this resonates with you and what, you, if you have anything to say. And, um, I love you guys and I appreciate all you like, your share, subscribes, and your comments. And if you want to get notified every time I load up these videos, you just need to be subscribed or to subscribe if you're not. And then you need to hit the bell icon. Because if you hit the bell icon, then you'll get emails saying there's new videos from me. Okay, guys, I hope to see you all again real soon. Thank you so much.